In this video, we are going to use the input dialog activity to save a value for later use. In this example, I've added an input dialog activity here. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna set it up so that um, whatever is inputted into the message box shown to the user, then that value will be saved um, for later, uh, saved as a value you can use for later. And in, the, in this example, we're gonna set it up so that you can insert that value into a um, into the body of an email. So we'll start with setting up our input dialog box. The dialog title, that's just the literal title of the message box that appears to the user. So we're gonna click on text and we're just gonna call it current month because we're gonna ask the user to insert the current month. The input label, what that is, is the message that's shown to the user. So we're gonna tell the user to enter the current month. We'll leave input type as text box so they can enter any value they want. And the value entered, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use um, create, sorry, we're gonna create variable and we're gonna give that variable a name. And in this case, we're gonna call the variable current month. Now let's see what that looks like. So let's go ahead and run. And we can see the input label of our box is current month. And then the message says enter the current month and they can enter any value they want. So we'll just put in February and they click okay. And that will continue the flow. So let's go and in this example, I'm gonna enable this activity so that we can go down to um, the body of our send email activity. And we're going to go and just click on text. And the body of the email is just going to say the current month is. And then if we click on the little plus over here, we can go and grab our current month variable. So you can see the use variable. And we're going to go current month and current month as text and click save. Now, when we run this flow, the, the email that's created, what, the body of the email will include this message, the current month is, and it will insert the value of whatever you, um, whatever the user enters up here when the message box is displayed during the flow. It'll save that value and it'll insert it um, into the body of the email. And that is how you use the input dialog activity to save a value for later use. In this case, um, to use the value uh, to create a email um, body message. Thanks for watching everyone. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.